Welcome back to AI Quest. Today we're going to be taking a look at something that completely blew my mind and continues to do so, which is real-time AI image generation. Now this is a huge leap forward in AI art generation, and there are multiple different platforms that are doing this right now in different ways, and we're just going to have a look at them, see which one's the best right now. Oh, and I'll only be looking at the free options, because there are a lot of expensive AI apps out there right now, but there are also a lot of free ones, some of which you may never have heard of before. So let's take look at some of the options that are out there right now. Now we're starting off with a very simple hugging face space created by foul.ai. They're calling it real-time latent consistency model for stable diffusion. So this will be the first link in the description. If you've used hugging face before you know you have to log in with a github account first that is completely free obviously. And then if you go to the link you'll end up on this screen here which we have our initial image on the left and our generated image on the right. Pretty self-explanatory. Down here we have a prompt so you do need to fill in a prompt of what you're actually drawing. So let's try something like a llama riding a skateboard all right so we got a little pen here we can change the size of our pen and we also have a color swatch here that we can change the color so maybe for a llama let's do sort of an yellowy orange and let's try to draw a llama here obviously i suck at drawing oh and we actually get an error this was working fine a moment ago <laughs> so i guess a lot of people are using this right now or there's some sort of other error let's try a refresh try again okay so we're still getting this error message anyway try this out for yourself this was working <laughs> i swear this was was working a moment ago try it for yourself we'll be moving on to the next one um, also the last one is my favorite so stick around for that it's truly awesome but next up we have leonardo ai's new ai canvas or live canvas i should say we have the ai canvas and we have the live canvas this is completely free you probably already know leonardo ai one of the best free ai image generators out there so if you log into the app and you go to live canvas you'll be taken here now again we can fill in our prompt so let's see if this one will work a llama riding a skateboard and there we already have a llama riding a skateboard let's see what happens if we make this orange and I want the llama in a different position so let's put him like that there we go it matched the position of our llama let me just give it a little more detail. <laughs> okay, that's my llama. So I want him side facing. So let's see if we draw some legs here. And then we'll make the brush a little smaller. Switch it to, I don't know, black. Oh, that doesn't work, does it? Let's change it to white or gray. And draw the skateboard. Oh my god, I'm terrible. But this will demonstrate how good it is even with terrible drawing. Just with a mouse and no talent whatsoever. And there we have it, our llama. Now we can also change the background color very easily like this. If we make it blue... Now we have a blue background. I have no idea what it's done to the skateboard, but we can draw like some clouds in here, terrible clouds. And it actually recognizes that that is the sky now without us actually prompting it. So let's try prompting it. Blue sky, fluffy clouds. There we go. Now we can put some ground underneath this llama. Oh, that was not the right button. We have to change back to brush. Let's try putting some grass underneath, even though you can't skate on grass. Anything's possible in AI. All right, so it noticed it's ground, but it's not actually grass. All we have to do is type grass and I'll change it. It's just, it just feels so magical that it changes while you're doing it and this isn't even the real-time mode this is the interactive mode it feels almost real-time i mean every time you finish a line so every time your mouse button unclicks it will update the image on the right now if you have premium you can do real-time mode which will make it even more real-time but i mean it honestly really isn't necessary at all also we can change our style here or you can just leave it on dynamic so it'll change it as you go let's change it to photography and let's maybe add a little bright orange sun in the sky okay that didn't work let's undo that make it actually a proper circle and let's type that in sunny or sun let's make it a bit bigger sun in the sky okay it doesn't it's just doing some lens flare it doesn't really seem to like doing the sun maybe if we remove this cloud oh so there's the sun now but I want it over here. There we go. It's just so cool to see it change while you're drawing. I mean, truly, truly feels magical. So yeah, that's Leonardo AI's live real-time image generation. Very cool, completely free. Let's move on to the next one. So next up we have the Stable Diffusion XL Turbo, which is a huge leap forward in Stable Diffusion. I believe the Leonardo one also runs off SDXL Turbo. I'm not actually sure about that now. I'll look that up. So with this one, you only get a couple of free generations, I believe, and then you have to start paying for their pro plan. If you head over to this clip drop page, link in the description, obviously you'll come to this text prompt. As soon as you click on it, you'll open this canvas and we can type in our prompt. So a llama, and it should be changing while we type. So a llama riding a skateboard <laughs> or another llama that's pretty good actually and there we have it so we can just keep adding to this prompt and it will keep changing it in real time so let's say 
on grass in the rain. There we go. Very, very cool. Being chased by another llama. Didn't like that. A human. Well, it's running away, but there's no human there. And then we can change it back to sunny. We can also change what the llama looks like. We can say a blue llama. And there we go. Our llama is now blue. So this is, so obviously this is very cool. I'm really excited to see where this goes because SDXL was already really good and now real-time generation with so little steps. Usually it will take like 20 to 40 steps to generate a good image, but this is only using one or two steps, I believe. So that's pretty crazy. So this next one I'm going to show you is drawfast.tldraw.com. This doesn't use Stable Diffusion XL Turbo. And as you can see, it uses that full AI that we saw. But this is a very unique one, and I'll show you why. It's very cool. So when you get to the page, you have to click this cursor icon, and then you can double click this to enter a prompt. So we're going to say again, a llama riding a skateboard. Hit enter. And now we can draw that llama. And as you can see right before for our eyes in real time it is generating our llama riding a skateboard as the other one was but the very cool thing about this there's a couple cool things actually so if we say on a grass and then we overlay the image onto the canvas using this arrow and we grab our green pen we should be able to draw some grass underneath this llama hmm, i'm not sure why that's not working let's just reload this for a second okay there we go so if we overlay this onto the canvas and maybe we'll type in blue sky and we grab our pen and we make it blue and we start drawing in the sky look at that in real time on the same canvas i mean that is so cool there we go now again we can add add a sun maybe in the sky there there we go it did it without even having to prompt it let's add some clouds in the sky with this gray maybe there we go let's see if we can change the color of the llama to purple Oh, there we go. It's getting a purple hue. There we go. A purple llama riding a skateboard. Isn't that the coolest thing ever? We can just change this in real time. Look at that. I mean, I keep saying it, but the, isn't this just magical? So yeah, that's TL Draw. Draw fast at TL Draw. Check that one out. Now, the last one is very cool because we can actually use stock icons um, and some other things I'll show you. It is Picasso by Freepik. You might know Freepik. Well, they have their own real-time AI image generator now. Now, when you go to this site, you will need an invite code. I just found one randomly by googling it the code i found was linus i don't know who it belongs to but you can use that and you'll instantly get in and as you can see we have these icons here that we can actually move around so we can't only draw we can actually use these pre made icons to change our scene look how cool this is if we grab the sun we make it go down look at that and look it changes the colors like the sun is actually going down oh it just changed the sun to a building but that's okay we can just pull it back up this feels so crazy to do so let's move the boat up for a bit and then we can draw in some water let's make the water take up more of the screen put the boat back there not quite sure how to bring this to the foreground but that's okay that's not necessary if we take a look at some of these other items here we can grab a tree put that on the island there we go maybe a few more beautiful let's make this more of a grassy color there we go there's our island maybe some mountains in the background enlarge that isn't this amazing and there we go there's our output image we can enhance this as well and there we go it enhanced our image so let's try our classic prompt again by removing everything a llama riding gate board there we have our llama to make it grass again don't know why i keep making grass but i just want to check out the differences between all these tools so here we go let's make our skateboard okay and let's pop an orange llama on top oh my god i'm so good at drawing don't know what happened here now but <laughs> that's okay i'm doing a i'm doing a terrible job at this that's okay there we have it exactly what we wanted a llama with a tiny baby llama on top let's make it wear a top hat maybe that'll be cool let's see if we can do that wearing a top hat oh top hat there we go but we want it wider there we go we can make it as wide as we want not really a top hat anymore but there's our llama and yeah i'm just so impressed with these tools just think of the possibilities if you're an artist or a creative person, if you can change your AI art in real time just by drawing, I mean, this is the future of art generation. So yeah, if you like this video, you'll probably like this one as well. Thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you could subscribe, it would mean the world to me. And I'll see you next time.